Hi Digital Planners, this is Tina Phillips from A Wild Plan and today I'm going to do kind of a throwback um, on importing a Wild Plan uh, planner into GoodNotes because uh, the way I do things is a little bit different and we're getting a lot of new people trying out digital planning and some people are getting a little confused about um, how to open it. And the what I do is because I already kind of do a little bit of the work and give you a sticker set inside of your planner that's already brought in individually for you just to get the, you know, get out on start on a good start just to start running with your planner with some stickers. Um, I export my planners as a goodnotes.zip file. So when you purchase a planner from me, you're going to get a file name .goodnotes.zip file and you do not unzip it. That is a GoodNotes native file and I also recommend it when you're backing up. That is the format you should be backing up to so GoodNotes does not lose all your notes and things like that. So I'm going to show you uh, right now um, by importing the rose gold um, planner right now. So what you want to do is um, in your iPad in the upper left hand corner you see that little plus sign. You want to click that and you want to hit import. Now I'm assuming that you've already downloaded the files somewhere uh, to a Dropbox cloud, um, even on you know uh, Google Google Drive, whatever one of those cloud storages, or even to your files. Now that uh, iOS has updated, they have a files app, and I choose to use the iCloud Drive and get to Dropbox that way. So I'm going to go to Dropbox Personal, navigate to where I've saved this planner. And I have cried a bit. There we go. And as you can see in the upper right hand corner or upper left hand corner, I have a zip file that says, and what I'm also finding here is if I need to cloud it, I need to download it first. Now it's processing. And there's my uh, there's my planner right there. So what I want to do is just go ahead and double click on that. And I can see my planner. And if I'm in the up, I'm in the no write zone, in the no write uh, uh, phase where you open that, you have that little icon that has a pen and a little line through it that's a um, that's selected. You can go ahead and select your little clamshell paperclip right there, and it goes straight to your uh, stickers page. So you can start using your your stickers right away. And um, you uh, should also see that that your very first page is going to be your cover that you can decorate and do whatever you want to with it. And you can just start using your planner as needed. Thanks. Bye.